Hello there, so welcome back to another Knox Travels video. I'm Neil and we are doing my first day in Manila. I was here last night, had a little look around, but here we're now we're heading off to Intramuros. I've got myself a grab, it's the best way to get around the city. And uh, my driver here, Michael. Oh. Sheesh! Shout out to Michael. <laughs> he wants to be on the vlog. Oh. So we, we're doing the intro now uh, with my, my new friend, Michael. <laughs> He's going to drive me to, to Intramuros. Yeah, yeah, sir. Show me the sights. Let's get it on. I think we should be driving past Dolomite Beach on the way. Is that yeah. is that the right way? Yeah. Dolomite? Yeah. Malati? Yeah, you will see that. We go past there. Yeah. He'll show me a few sights. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, we're heading to um, Intramuros to do some tours, to check out the history. I thought my first day in Manila, I thought I've got to go to Intramuros. It's the old part of the city. We have to see that first and then uh, we can talk about the history and uh, it gives you more of an understanding about the Filipino culture. So uh, here we go. Let's see some of the drive. <laughs> uh, follow, like and share to Sir Knox Travel. You heard it from him. More power. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm all suited up. Look, I've got my um, safety equipment on. We're going on one of these. A Segway. I don't think they call them Segway. Segway is a brand name, isn't it? So they're probably not Segway, but I uh, don't know what they call them. Like, are we ready? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, bye. Later. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you got. <laughs> Slowly. Slowly. Our first destination is uh, San Agustin Church. San Agustin Church. Yes, sir. And one of the oldest church here in the Philippines. And it was oh. built in 1572. Oh. And the age of this church is 453 years. The structures and the design are very original. Never been renovated. Very nice. And, yes, sir. And at this side called Museo San Agustin. After our tour, if you want to go there later. And the museum. Yes, yes sir. Take I think there are um, entrance fee to pay, I think, for 200 pesos. 200 pesos entrance fee. Let's go, sir. Next okay. I can't believe my tour guide's wearing a jacket, that's crazy. Sure. Wearing a jacket. Yeah. I'm so hot. <laughs> Are you used to it? You feel uh, the cold when we're driving? You feel the uh, wind? Yeah. Uh. Your lift? Good, good, good. <laughs> <laughs> 
So um, I wanted to do this tour because something different doing a little Segway tour. Uh, I thought I've seen a lot of people doing um, bamboo bikes, and I didn't want to do the same as other people. And I managed to find this, and I thought it was a really good idea. Ah, I've seen this before. I know what this is. This is um, old presidents. Turn you around. I want to do the tour guide's job for her. Officer, our second destination is the Galeria de los Presidentes de la República Filipina. A former president here in the Philippines, starting with Emilio Aguinaldo. First, first one. Yes, sir. Then down to Rodrigo Duterte. Ah, then, Duterte up yes, there. Yes, sir. But not the latest. No, no. Only because, when they finished, the one because, goes up. Um, he he did not finish her term. All oh, right. Then after his term, he he posted the picture of um President oh, after Marcos the term Jr. That goes up. Jr. Ah, yes, sir. So it's past presidents. Yes, sir. Uh, not current. Past Ah, I see. We have, we have two ladies president, uh, Gloria Macapagal Arroyo ah. and Corazon Aquino. Very good. Yes, sir. Then at this side, called Portal de Santa Lucia, the house or the barracks of the Filipino soldiers before. Uh -huh. And now it serves as a military trainee for the aspiring military. Ah, ah, yes, sir. Training. Then this wall is run by the Intramuros called Moralia, the Spanish world of wall. Uh, sir, then may I borrow your phone, sir? Then take a picture at the center. Yes. Okay. Sandy Lang. <laughs> oh, crash, crash. Okay. establishment okay yes sir then at this side called former site of San Ignacio Church the most beautiful church before because of the unique style and design inside inside uh -huh. and now serve as a museo, museo the call of this museo is Museo de Entramuros then open of this museo is only Saturday and Sunday on this uh -huh. okay, sir, let's go our last destination the Santiago.
Salamat. The Mariones is house or the barracks of the American soldiers before. Okay. And during the Spanish, um, during the Japanese time, sir, is uh, we have a tunnel here to connect the Fort Santiago uh -huh. to secretly attack the Filipino soldiers at Fort Santiago. Then the main entrance of this tunnel is our hotel. Just closer to our Fort Santiago. So uh, the Filipinos would be on this side, yes, sir, there. and the uh, yeah, Japanese would be the other side. And, and the, the Japanese is here. The Japanese in here, and, and, and the Filipino here. here. Ah. What's this? Second World War? Huh? Second World War? Yeah. Then you want to take a picture at the center? That's no, okay. I'll, uh, I've got my camera. What are you doing? Fort Santiago is the house or the barracks of the Filipino soldiers before. Uh, take a picture at the center, sir. Off-center. Quede?
cover sa Abujal, the LP booster with mo and the no limit ang here inside. Yes sir. Then let's go to the next destination, the dungeon. This is uh, Jose Rizal? Uh, it's here on the statue? Yes, it's the statue of Rizal. The height of Rizal is 4'11". 4'11"? Yes, sir. Oh my god! So short! Yes. Typical. Typical yes. Filipino. 18 languages, no of no... Uh, Rizal. There you go, that one. Then he, he has uh, 21 girl friends. 21 girl, no wife? Because of their lack of food. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Then let's park Stand our chariot, sir. Then visit the dungeon. Oh. I sir, visit and I give you a. Uh, 10 minutes, I have 15 minutes. Ah, uh, me? On my own? Yes, sir. Ah. So, um, we've got 600 prisoners, it says, we found. Locked inside the dungeons left by Japanese, just, just left them there, locked up. You're entering hallowed grounds, please protect yourself with dignity. Oh my god, this is um, very uh, small. Ed We just have some uh, shocking images on the walls. Uh, yeah, I think these are definitely it's uh, demonetization images there, so I will be showing them. buildings but because of uh, Iglesia de San Nicolas de Tolentino San Sanin Akio, Seninakio Church, Seninakio, how you say it? Aduana? That roof isn't Lego. You are the Lords. There's uh, Francisco. colors
Cathedral. Cathedral of Manila. See inside? Can't see inside. something very different there's other ways of getting around you can get around by horse by tricycle like I said bamboo bikes there here it is but never seen anyone do these segways so um yeah that's my aim is to do things different from everyone else even when you're doing the same things Okay, so if you enjoyed that, um, you can book this directly, directly through White Knight Hotel. Um, it's a great little way to look around the city. Uh, I booked it through Kluke. It was 900 pesos for one hour. But if you go directly through White Knight Hotel, then you get to um, do this for 500 pesos, they said. So it's almost half the price if you go direct through the hotel. Really great way of looking around um, the city of Intramuros. I had a great time. Uh, I'm going to now go around, wander around in Tromoros myself, take a little look around. So um, I'm going to end this video here um, as a, just a solo tour. Um, I was lucky enough to have a solo tour. Sometimes there's a lot more people, but um, I got a solo one. For, uh, it was just sheer luck. I didn't book a solo. Uh, but there you go. I had a nice little tour. I hope you've enjoyed this video and uh, found something new to do on your travels to Manila. So um, thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video. Goodbye. <laughs>